Let's talk about it. Two times a judge can ignore a jury's verdict. In rare cases, judges can overturn a jury's verdict with a judgment notwithstanding the verdict. In civil cases, jurors sometimes award. So judge cool. can overturn it. You don't replenish management. But don't expect judges to save you. Damn. Incredibly strong to get a JNOV. Most of the time, a jury has a final say on the front, but. Drain. 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 One level more Drain. than a carpenter. I'm in a cave with my friends and I'm busy killing mob. I can't understand why people come out. What you gonna type, noob? LFG, no more. Listen, bro. I understand what you're saying. But I'ma help them understand what you're saying. Basically, this out of this out of girl I mean. Where? Who? You been where? Where who? Mm. For real. I'm the G. Oh real. But you can call That's me. That's how you feel. Well, you guys are like the asking truth. all them questions. Asking all them questions. Why you asking all them questions? Are Making statements. Working for uh, us. Asking all them questions. Asking all them questions. Why you asking all them questions? That Making statements. Keep uh, stop. Uh, uh, find Mount Everest. Where you been? He was Ravenhead. How much? How much? How much did you spend? Yeah, I trust you. Now unlock your phone. Uh 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 uh. Who is this? How? See why you playing with me? The did same it? reason why you ain't stand with me. You trying to get up in these drawers? You ain't with me. They ain't even trying to hear what you saying to me. Just grab your stuff, hit the door, go chill with them other girls. Wait, he's why I'm so He's managed to open a doll stand in the shadow of the hem. He seemed to look down That's upon everyone it. around and him. And you the peppy? Eh, <laughs> looking stupid. That's what you're getting. Cleaning up after your cook. Good dress. Thinking that you're slick. <laughs> but you dumb. You stupid? How don't you talk when I'm talking? You better mute it. Now mm -hmm. unlock your phone, let me see them Open pictures up. I'm gon' check your Facebook And I'ma check your Twitter And I bet it tell me where Who? You been where? Where who? <clears throat> uh, for real? Oh really? That's how you feel? Why are you asking questions? Asking all them questions Why are you asking all them questions? Making statements Uh who? Asking all them questions. Help you on the time. What's up? Some yet sick games. Asking all them questions. Why are you asking all them questions? Making statements. A sweet girl. You come in. Oh, my man, shut up. What is you still? Who you find here? So you saw a nine here. Who you not lead up on there? You see what now was? How you find what you said you it ain't mine I'm 
nih iu. We're not strangers to love. You know the rules, and so do I. Our lost net, our money, our strength, our commitment to what I am. Think of. Yeah. 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 When I go run up the end, she gon' be all on my skin, all on my skin. Said that I look like a kid, I could make her feel young again. Young girl, I'm going to lose your mind. One, two, three. Okay, hold on. What's up, YouTube? It's your girl Faith in the Cut. You already know what it is. It's your girl Rosario. Period. <laughs> so, y'all, we are at my house. Oh, how much do I should be right now? Oh, you're real. It's in my stuff. Hey, oh, it's just like how I'm back. What's up? Whoop. before I always be at a Z house so y'all about to just see my room so for y'all 
Okay, okay. whatever you get to do with you, I do just for you. Okay. 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 Welcome to Faith and Z Vlogs. <laughs> One, two, ready, go. Look, I'm calling you. Get a hide Oh, I got my shoes on. Let me. Did you? What? Let me like the What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Like, you know how, like, Clifford the red dog, he be eating, like, the water. Like, what? Y'all just really like Stop Oh let me go make my pasta Stop playing with it Pick it up Is this some pasta? Y'all I have a Bro this is some good light Hold on look Let me show y'all It's not evened out But like Let's see Let's see how good the focus is on this Oh Oh done I'm not gonna eat no bread That's fine I wanna be where you are. What? Yeah, shut up. What well, damn? <laughs> what are you doing to my hair? Alright, yeah, I'm gone. Can we shut the door? Alright. What's up, y'all? What is this? No, that's nothing. That's nothing. That's nothing. Oh, okay. What's up, y'all? Thought it was something on me. Mm -mm. Take three. What's up, y'all? We are back. We already did our intro, so I don't know why I just did that, but we are in the car chilling. We got our food. You got your food. And y'all. It's currently 8 59 p.m. on a Wednesday noon. On a Wednesday evening. 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 You know, I never knew the difference between afternoon and evening. Are you serious? Yeah. Afternoon is afternoon. I feel like afternoon is like One between the ages. Two. I mean, not between ages. Evening is like four like, to like, even is like four to seven. So afternoon is like two to three? What? Because you just said four to yeah, seven. Yeah, afternoon evening. is like two to three. Like it's still in the afternoon. Like 12 o'clock is like, 12.30 is afternoon. One o'clock, I afternoon. thought evening was like the time the sun set tonight. Oh, wait, no, that wouldn't even like, be that. Anyway, yeah, y'all, I don't know why we just having this debate about that, but. Anyway, can you get some cores? And while you at it, what? while you at it, I do got something. Oops, I do got something to show you. Do you? While you at it, yeah. I've been wanting to show you this for a long ass time. Though. I bet you do. No, for real. I bet. Go ahead. No, I got this bottle. You never seen it? What did you think I was about to show you? Yeah, I got this pretty, pretty. Pretty glass bottle. I'm gonna put all my coffee and frappes in it. But okay, for, for I do got something for you though. Look at this. Yo, what the heck, baby? What? I mean, I know you like what so you you're showing, and I can't. It's almost like, taking it's almost, activity. It's almost like a no kiss and tell. Or stop playing with me, Phil. It's not funny. Show me. Show me something. I'm going to let you know how it feels to be violated. Okay, close your eyes. I mean, close your eyes. <laughs> you, know? you can do that. Close your eyes. Well, you can close your eyes. Ray, close your eyes. Okay, I don't know what you got up her sleeve. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. I'm closing them. Okay. I'm going to just, I ain't going to even show. I'm just going to put it in your face right when you, I'm just going to put it in your face. As soon as you open your eyes, so you can see it. You can just, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. I'm scared, y'all. I don't know what she about to show me. I wish you got up her sleeve. Cause okay, put your hands down, baby. So you don't. Okay. 
All right, go ahead. Open your eyes, take a deep breath in. What do you smell? <laughs> Why would you do that? Do what? Bro, it smell like baloney. Shut your ass no, up. No, I'm telling you, I didn't stink. You didn't stink. Bro, you know what I'm saying? I know you so well. I know you was about to do that. Oh, okay. I know you was about to do that. Come here. I know you. Harmony. I want to be where the birds are. I can show you some birds. I want to be where the toddlers Look. are. Sucking. Look. Breast. Huh? Hee <laughs> hee. Oh. Do you wish? Do you wish they was bigger? Oh. Do you wish they was bigger? No. You like them this time? I like them a little itty bitty titty. You ever heard of the little the itty, itty bitty, bitty titty? titty? No, you no no no. You ever heard of the itty bitty spider with the waterfall? You know what I'm saying? With the ass. You know what I'm saying? What are you singing? <laughs> so I like them itty bitty titty. Mm-hmm. All right, let me see. Let me see your hand again. You must. Do you want to make OnlyFans or something? I mean, I'm with it. I don't care. Cause you just record I mean, it. I I make OnlyFans with you. Stop lying, bro. I would. And do what? What are we gonna do? Each other's makeup. <laughs> Cause you what, not gonna get on there and what show. Y'all, what y'all want to see on my OnlyFans? Get on, on. Get on live and show me them. You know what I'm saying? You're not finna do that. You're not finna okay, show that on only on OnlyFans. You're not, okay, I'm gonna make not. one. I'm gonna make one. I'm just playing. I know but you playing. You wouldn't do that. I don't need to make one. Neither would I. Just do I. This, Why do I need to make one if I can just do this? You gonna keep doing it with the camera on? You you want me to be exposed? You want my 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 ethnicity and my environmental activities to be exposed? <laughs> Cause you you keep I mean well damn put them in my mouth put them in my mouth okay come wah, on wah, wah. Ga, 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 ga. come here ga 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 <laughs> mm. girl you said mm, like you getting some milk all right now you being weird that's not what I said mm. but it's okay I don't know what else to do should we go get some ice cream real quick that would bust that would like bust like bust you know what I'm saying. That will bust. But you know what's crazy? My bad. That will bust. I wonder if you make ice cream. Do like this. No, I just burped. Do like that. You were irritating. Hold on, y'all. In the 2002 series, he was called Zara Rista. He is now a married man. Officials confirm Lee Boyd Mowinder and Mo of Ireland are all seeing on the air. I'm going to get these out of my face. Virginia. Unless you want me to do something about it. Do you want me to do something with them? Yes or no? Regulate inmate weddings. Witnesses and guests are restricted to a maximum of six. But Murphy and Thompson are for some vending machines. Bro, turn the camera. I'm not about to do that on camera. If you're not gonna do it on camera, you're not gonna do it off camera. You gotta show okay, them that you I'll really show you. Okay, let me show. Turn the camera off and I'm gonna show you. But I want you to show them. I'm gonna show you first so you can know I'm serious. But I know you're serious because you no, I don't know if I'm serious. So turn the camera off and then we're gonna find out. I don't trust you. No, I'm serious. Turn the camera off, Faith. Hold on, y'all. I'm gonna just get straight to the point. I'm done with this video. All right, y'all. That's it for the vlog.
And she really does, she still has a judgment about gay marriage. She's must who she has any notion. Self, bro, and this is her mess need a new and a lot of be saying, my girl, what's that? So keep saying it. Yes, I know. I mean, I just know I'm no with the celebs who in so he and become me. See, now let's talk with no shit. The sequel for the fan of evil. It's mass mustn't. The surf plus no seat with their own shows. Ellen likes to be kind to the audience, such as in one case where she did a giveaway for the crowd. It wasn't a lot. She gave away a bunch of There was only one catch. Each audience member could only get one item. Gee, I wonder what happened. Room with cameras. Likely for giggles, but also to make sure that guests followed the rules. Or to see if any touching moments occurred. And lo and behold, one did when one woman wanted both a t-shirt and a hat, but couldn't because of the rule. So her friend offered to buy her that hat later on. A very nice then went and made passes and lied to other audience members just so she could get even more swag for herself. She insulted Ellen's kindness, and now she has to live with the shame. When she tried to explain herself, Ellen wasn't buying it one bit, and proved while Ellen is a great lady in front, she threw her in her show's jail just so it could be very clear what she had done and how wrong it was. The lesson here? If Ellen does a kind thing for you, to help bake some rice balls too, she said, the woman who can't cook made the perfect ball. Is that a ball? Ah! Oh my god, the woman who can't cook wow. made the perfect ball. That's amazing. Ellen and Kidman later teamed up to take down Jada, including insulting the renowned chef's bread. Jada did... There. There, it's all fixed. Focus on the food and be nice when something doesn't turn out right. That's called class, and that's not something that should have to be explained. I had to go right for it and ask each other things and give very pointed responses to the other. It started out very fun, and then it got a bit real, like really real. For example, Hayes made fun of how Ellen sometimes struggles with interview questions, like going from one question to another smoothly. Then Ellen fired back about how Will and Grace got canceled, to which Hayes fired back, I think it was longer than your sitcom was on. Ellen's response? Yeah, that's right. I had to come out first for y'all to do that sitcom. How long was it the first time around before no. y'all got canceled? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I think
he was longer than your sitcom. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's right. I the two joined in a genuine laugh, with Hayes even admitting, it's funny because it's true. So yeah, there were some insults flown, but in the end, it was a good contest of barbs between friends, and that's to be praised. Unlike some other people who went after Ellen, and definitely not being her friend. Number 4. Wendy Williams Wendy Williams has made a career of throwing insults and shade, which has made her very popular. Yet it's also made her a target of those who didn't appreciate the shade. She also had beef with Ellen for reasons described as personality clashes. But likely, it was just something Wendy perceived as a thing when it really wasn't. As two of the top ladies of talk shows, they occasionally go onto each other's programs, including one time when Wendy went onto Ellen's show and things didn't go so well. Ellen asked her why she threw some shade on Kanye West and Kim Kardashian while they were expecting their first child. This was back in 2013. And Williams played it off. But then in support of Ellen, Williams applauded her veganism and her PETA support. But then she asked, how can you live without bacon? Ellen wasn't amused with the question and went, well, because I think pigs are very smart animals. I know you're totally vegan. Yeah, but that's all right. How I do mean, you live without bacon? Well, because I, I think pigs are smart animals. They're, They're very cute. smart animals. And when Williams came back a few years later, she made a joke that Ellen and Justin Bieber were said to look alike. And some people say that he looks like you. I've heard that. You've never heard that? They say it in a good way. Do I look like Justin Bieber? No, they have made the equation. Oh, well. That's that, in a good way. I don't mind that. He's cute. He's adorable. Yeah. 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 No one should be compared to Bieber, and I think we should just leave it there. Number three, Justin Timberlake. Justin Timberlake is one of the most popular singers and celebrities in the world, no doubt. So naturally, he made an appearance on Ellen after a while. Except one time, Ellen made a mistake on camera, and he called her out on it hard. You see, they had been drinking tequila while playing one of Justin's songs. While this was going on, Ellen messed up one of the lines to the song. Justin was not amused, as he couldn't believe she didn't know the lyrics. Ellen noted it was an honest mistake, and even asked the audience for help. But Justin wasn't having it. Then, her own DJ turned on her and played the song in question, and made it very clear just how much she screwed up. So what's the lesson here? Well, there's fault on both sides. First, drinking and singing should never go together unless it's karaoke segment, you know? Second, Justin should have given Ellen some slack for not knowing the song, but Ellen should have known the song ahead of time if this was a planned thing. Not the most harmful of insults, but definitely one that got Ellen a bit hot under the collar because of the dunce spotlight put on her. Number 2. Jennifer Lawrence There's a line that you need to respect when you go onto a show like Ellen, especially if you think bad-mouthing gay people is a good idea. That goes double when the host is Ellen DeGeneres, a confirmed lesbian with a wife. And yet, Jennifer Lawrence not only crossed the line she shouldn't cross, she continued to make jokes that made Ellen very uncomfortable and angry. This all started during the interview, where Lawrence made a joke about her own cat, which was fine at first, except that the joke was that she called her cat, which was female, Chaz Bono, because of the cat's masculine energy. You not want that. Yeah, little you, Chaz Bono. And you got her, is that, is that her name? Chaz Bono is the son of legendary duo Sonny and Cher, and Chaz is transgender, which Ellen fully supports and doesn't like to hear insulted. Jennifer didn't stop after the joke was made, though. She went into a rant of sorts about cats, cat genders, and other very odd things. Ellen was poised the whole time. Eventually, once Lawrence was done with her gender rant, Ellen did the only thing she could. She moved away from the bad joke and went on to another topic, making it obvious that she wasn't happy about what happened, but didn't want to explode on Lawrence. Which Lawrence definitely noticed because she was shell-shocked by how quickly the conversation changed. Lawrence definitely made a mistake here, and you have to wonder if she understood what she did or not. Number 1. Caitlyn Jenner after the birth of Caitlyn Jenner, many people wanted to talk to her and get views on things. And it's led to tense situations and in interviews, including a very poignant encounter with Ellen. To be fair, when they did their first interview together, Ellen was all for Caitlyn and her fight for the rights of transgender people. And it all seemed to be going great until Caitlyn started to talk about her feelings on gay marriage. To refresh, Ellen is not just gay, she's happily married. 
According to Jenner, she was once very opposed to it because of her traditionalist nature, which is the logic behind many such people's beliefs against gay marriage. But when Jenner tried to recover and say she was okay with it now, Ellen wasn't biting. Not one bit. She called Caitlyn Jenner out on it, and that's when things got really awkward. I mean, I kind of like tradition, and, you know, it's always been a man and a woman. And uh, I'm thinking, I don't quite get it. After the interview, Ellen stated that she still didn't understand Jenner's position on the matter of gay marriage. Caitlyn Jenner is on, on the show today, our first show, and she really does, she still has a judgment about gay marriage. She said, if the word marriage is that important, and I was like, it is because that's the word. Furthermore, Ellen offered Caitlyn the chance to dance with her, but she wouldn't do it. So Ellen said, maybe she didn't want to dance with me because I'm a lesbian. Jenner later responded that she didn't like how Ellen treated her. Does she not remember what exactly happened? Because it was the other way around of not being treated right. I told her my progression and it was totally taken out of context because, you know, this is a progression over 20 years. I, I came from a different generation. So what do you think? What do you think of these people who insulted Ellen on her own show? Which of these barbs or jests do you think was the best or the cruelest? Do you know of another celebrity who threw shade at Ellen? Let me know in the comments below. Be sure to subscribe and I'll see you next time on the channel. A simple reminder on how to enter our brand new giveaway. We will be giving away either an iPhone X Max, the new iPad mini, or a MacBook Pro. It's really your choice. So be sure to leave a like, comment the keyword, subscribe, and turn on notifications to enter the giveaway. It's really that simple. Go for it.